hey guys welcome back to the channel hope you guys are doing well in today's video as you guys can see from the screen thumbnail and title we are going to be getting our first ever bundesliga torch player which is an objective player nicholas beste he is one of one of the most interesting player in bundesliga right now if you see because uh he is playing for heidenheim the team that has been promoted to bundesliga this season and uh, the team is doing really well they are at 10th place right now in the squad i mean in the uh, in the league table if you guys uh, follow bundesliga and he is actually this particular player nicholas beste is actually uh, been involved in a couple of goals for that particular team heidenheim this season as well and he's actually pretty good in free kicks if you guys go and uh, you know watch some of his highlights some of his games uh for this team in bundesliga this season he's been involved in a couple of free kicks and he has been scoring some bangers with free kicks with this left foot so this is the player we are going to be uh, getting today and seeing how he is in game looking at his um, stats and all these numbers and stuff so yeah first off let's get all these path subs i mean objective uh, sub objectives and then get the card i'll show you the card in detail once we put him in the team and then straight away we'll go ahead and play squad battles and see how his stats are if it is good to the card stats or if it's just uh, overrated or if it's underrated and if this objective is really great or not we'll look all of that in today's video let us get started first off let us collect all the rewards uh, actually before collecting all the rewards i'll just tell you guys what you have to complete to uh, get this card in general so first you have to play nine matches with at least three german players in your squad and you have to uh, win seven matches with five bundesliga players in your squad you guys can complete this objective in under two hours guys i completed this objective in two hours as soon as it got released i completed it in 2 hours i am recording it a bit late because i had some other videos to edit and stuff so i just pushed this video off uh apart from that you just have to play 9 games i just have 3 bundesliga play i mean 3 three german players with 5 bundesliga players and you are good to go you just have to win 7 games and play 9 games and you have to get uh an assist with a through ball in 4 separate games that is this one and apart from that the final one is going to be <coughs> scoring seven goals i think this is this is the one that is a uh, precise finisher you have to just score seven goals it doesn't matter with whom you score you just have to score seven goals and you will get this beautiful card 90 rated left mid and his alternate position is going to be interesting because i'm pretty sure some of you guys might be looking for a good left winger so this alternate position is left wing because even i am in search of a good left winger i just completed the evolutions for uh, premier league torch and i got 93 rated uh, gabriel martinelli this 84 card i took to 93 rated so i am actually in search for some of the good left wingers in in this in this game you know so i think i'm going to be happy with this person for some time but looking at his stats he has 92 pace he has 90 shooting 87 passing 90 dribbling 84 defense and 79 physical now when i saw 84 defense i thought you can play him at left wing wing back as well or left back but he can be played only in two positions which is left mid and left wing but his defense is actually pretty cool you know 85 stand tackle so you can easily tackle slide tackle 86 and coming to defense i mean dribbling is where i am actually curious he has 89 ball control so should he be able to you know get the ball to his feet and be able to keep the ball closer to his feet he has 90 dribbling as well he has 92 crossing guys 92 crossing which is really impressive for a winger and he has 96 print speed he has only 88 acceleration so it's going to take a while for him to start, get started but 96 print speed we will test it out 94 shot power and finishing is also pretty insane now his curve is only 82 so i don't know how it's going to be to you know you do a finish shot from outside the box or from the corner of the box but yeah 98 stamina as well he has three three play style pluses first one is finish shot plus just now we were talking how it's going to be and stuff so he has uh, finish 
shot plus which is play style plus and for passing he has two which is the tiki taka plus and pinched pass plus actually not bad and he has five star weak foot and four star skill move i mean four star skill move and five star weak foot as well my bad but yeah apart from that things are looking good his preferred foot is left so yeah that is what i was telling his free kicks were insane when i saw some of the highlights it was actually pretty good now his finishing is 94 short par 94 long shots also 91 or not bad long shot but i am wondering how it's gonna be when i you know curve because his curve is only 82 guys that is one thing i am concerned now let us actually go put him in the squad now you guys see this player picks right it, this is for tomorrow's video and once we are done with this player picks that is it going that is that is the you know no more pack opening still la liga tots are released because i am saving packs i have saved around 60 packs for la liga tots already because i am interested in the squads that might be released for la liga so make sure you guys also start saving now where is he see this is the card i was telling i did the um what do you call it i did the evolutions and i got gabriel martinelli now let's just add him and you know get to the game now i am using a 4-3-3 uh formation so i'll be using you know the uh, i'll be using him at left wing position which is his secondary position not his preferred position but still you know i this is how i play so i just want to see if he's good for the way i play and how he is in i mean it's still all left left mid is basically left wing but in a more wider position but we'll see how it is decent first touch his ball control is actually pretty decent you know i mean look at his his acceleration is so bad guys his acceleration is so bad like I could just feel it. I think I, it's like he wants to run past, but his something is happening to his knees or something. It's just funny to watch. But first impression, not a bad card. I mean, I know all of you guys are going to complete him irrespective of how the card is going to be because a 90 rated card is still a fodder card. But you guys should use all these cards that you get for free. I'm telling this to those who pay to, you know, uh, get packs and who also are lucky enough to get good cards from pack openings even if you're free to play try different players It'll, it's actually really fun i have a, a bunch of uh, left wingers left mid combinations you know and i try to use most of them just to have some spice in this whole game otherwise it's just kind of boring not gonna lie okay once he starts uh, going you know is actually his print speed is not bad Ooh, short par is also actually decent. Short par is also actually decent. No. Crossing is also actually pretty cool. It felt like a knuckleball cross or something. Now, as an objective, guys, this uh, this whole objective that is there we are right now, which we are doing, is also really good as an objective because under two hours, you can easily complete it. Like, even if you take a break after playing five games and then do the next four games you guys can easily complete this objective in under two hours because it is that easy it is that easy and this player is also not bad its player is also not bad for all those player people who are starting uh efc 24 just now or who have started like a month ago and are, are looking for good players in different positions if left wing is a position or left mid is the position you're looking for this player is actually pretty decent in that position. Now, I would suggest you guys start uh, looking into evolutions as well, which is a big part of this whole FC24 grind because uh, EA has given a lot of importance to uh, evolutions in this uh, game, guys. Like I showed you the 93 rated Gabriel Martinelli card, I had him at 84 gold card and Ooh. Nice, nice. Look at this kit. Look at this kit. This kit is insane. <clears throat> Not bad. He has good ball control, and his shot power is also really good. And his positioning is also pretty decent. You know, I don't know what his positioning uh, numbers were, 
but he's actually pretty decent guys i would definitely suggest using him especially uh, anybody who's watching is free to play and doesn't have a proper left wing left mid you guys can definitely experiment with him in your squad now this is going to be tricky because you need to get whole the whole league and uh, you know country what do you call that chemistry sorted but apart from that it's a pretty good card you guys can see how i'm scoring with him and i'm playing at world class or something like that i don't know a pretty decent card so i'm definitely suggest you guys completing this objective and you guys will be getting another objective review i think within the next next 4 5 days i'm guessing ea will be releasing one more uh, if i'm not wrong but yeah make sure you guys look into the evolution aspect also like i said a lot of evolutions are being updated like once in 2 days or once in 3 days so yeah i'll see you guys in the next video which is going to be like i said the 81 player pick for bundesliga i'll be doing that i don't know how it's going to be but i'll be opening 16 player picks for bundesliga and hopefully hopefully we'll have uh, we'll have a good time that is going to be a short video not going to be long like this but yeah now let me just finish this game you guys have a great day and i'll see you guys in the next one until then take care stay safe stay motivated and keep smiling guys bye bye